to enable presents mathematical literacy, finance, the second lesson on budgets, it's exercise B in fact. Right, now you have to say whether expenses are fixed or variable. Right, so a mortgage repayment is fixed, car payment is fixed, life insurance is fixed, household and car insurance is fixed, and pension is fixed. Salary after deduction, this is an income. Petrol is a variable cost. Foods for pet, food for pet and food and pet food is variable. Clothes are variable. Interest on credit card is variable. Um, service of a car is an irregular expense. Sorry. Um, uh, service of a car gives an irregular expense. Medicine is irregular and medical bills are irregular. School fees, it can be variable or fixed. It depends. Um, most school fees are fixed but can also be variable. Extra for school activities is variable. Dining out and movies, variable. Beauty and hair salon, variable. Uh, this can even be irre irregular. So let's quickly change this. I think that school fees can be can be fixed okay so let's make school fees a fixed expense um, dining out and movies or entertainment make it irregular beauty and hair salon irregular Variable is a monthly expense. Sorry, um, a month uh, municipal bill is variable. Uh, cell phone, telephone, and internet bills variable. Other expenses is variable. Bank charges variable, and the total for the income and the total for the expenses. Right, let's look at the next question. Calculate the income and expenses. We've just done it. Did you make a profit or a loss? Did they make a profit or a loss? A profit, sorry, not cloud the issue. Mm, sorry. Animations. Sorry about that. Okay, let's look at it again. Did they make a profit or a loss? A profit or a loss is an income minus expense. So they made a profit because they got 43,000 and the, expen the expense was 36,469 Rand. And that gave us a profit of 6,531 Rand. The family wants to start saving 12% of the income during the month. Calculate this amount, right? So 43,000 times 12% is 5,160 Rand. Remember the way that you would um, c calculate the, uh, that 12%, you will say 43,000 times with 12 divided by 100. Categorize each, okay, sorry, we just went through that. Um, name four things that this family can do to spend less money in order to save more money monthly. Okay, they can spend less on gifts or on dining out and movies, cell phones, telephones and internet and beauty and hair salon and maybe change their pet food brand. That's a way. Um, this family doesn't spend that much um, much money though uh, but a lot on food and pet food this is very high you can't really budget for medical expenses um, you're either ill or not you could maybe take more vitamins or eat more um, 
fresh fruit and vegetables, but then this will increase again. Okay, so less and gifts, dining out. Okay, so four things. Okay, the next exercise is commission. Now, um, I haven't asked you to do it, so you quickly have to go do it. Let's quickly look through it. When you work out commission, work for commission, you get a basic salary plus a percentage of your sales. So Astrid is a sales manager who works for, uh, for a company that sells fences. She earns 25000 a month plus 1% commission on all her sales. Okay, so calculate the monthly income in March if her sales were 560000 So you would take the 25000 and you add 1%, 1 over 100 is 1%, times 650000 uh, 1% of 650,000 is then 5,600 and that you will add onto your basic salary of 25,000. So she earned 30,600 during that month. Okay, so now let's look at this exercise about um, Okay. Marie earns a basic salary of 3500 a month and 4.5% commission on everything that she uh, sells. Uh, she sells th uh, 32,000 rands of goods in March. What, what is her salary? Okay, so that's, this is a basic salary, 3500 and then she will earn 4.5% of 32,000 rand worth of sales. Okay, now first you have to do 32,000 and multiply it by 3.5%. So you can either say times 3,5 divided by 100 or you can use your percentage button on your calculator. So she earned 4,940 rand. Dan is a sales agent who earns a basic salary of 5,000 rand and 6% commission on his sales. He sells goods to the worth of 10,000 rand for the month. What is his salary for this month? It's 5,000 rand plus 10,000 times 6%. Okay, 10,000 times 6% 6 is 600 rand. So his salary for the month was 5,600 rand. Okay, let's do this step by step again. Sorry for that. Okay, but it's luckily easy to fix. Rain earns 8% commission on all her sales and a basic salary of 5,475 Rand. How much money will she receive if her sales are 25,000 Rand for that month? Okay, so again, it's the 5,700. A 5,475 rand plus 8% of 25,000. So it's 5,475 plus 2,000 rand. And that is 5,475 rand. Clue earns no basic salary and 10% commission of her sales. If she sells good goods to the worth of 18,500 rand per month, what is her salary at the end of a month? Okay, so it's 18,500 times 10% and that is 1,850 Rand. Right, and question number five. Tina is a salesperson in a shop. She earns a basic salary of two and a half thousand and five percent commission on all sales more than a thousand rand. What will her monthly salary be if she sells goods for worth nine hundred rand? It will only be the two and a half thousand rand. What will her monthly salary be if she sells goods worth a thousand nine hundred rand? Okay, so it would be 2,500 plus 1,900 rand times 5%. 1,900 times 5% is 95 rand. So if she sells 
a thousand nine hundred rand during the month, she will earn two thousand five hundred and ninety five rand. Michael gets a basic salary of two thousand rand. He gets five percent commission of all sales up to five thousand rand. So if he sells more than five thousand rand, he earns twelve. 12% for the amount above 3, 000, oh, 5 thousand. How much money does he earn if he sells 8,000 rand worth of goods? Right, so it's his basic salary plus 5% 5 of 5,000 rand and then 12% of the amount, ab amount above 5,000. This is the equation. Okay, so we have to work out what 5% 5 of 5,000 is and 8,000 is 3,000 rand above 5,000. So 3,000 times 12%. Okay, 5% 5 of 5,000 is 250 rand and 12% of 3,000 is 360 rand. Add that together and he earns 2,610 rand. Thank you very much for watching. There is one lesson left. Please remember to do that exercise before you look at tomorrow's uh, lesson.